Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. All right, here's your forecast this evening. Around 80 at 7 o'clock, we will be looking at just a couple of uh, spotty clouds out there, partly to mostly sunny skies. More clouds again late night, 75 at 8 o'clock, 72 at 11 p.m. Very comfortable humidities this evening, but a little muggier tomorrow morning, 69 at 8 o'clock, really getting humid tomorrow afternoon. And also with the increased humidity level, chances some thunderstorms tomorrow afternoon. We should get up into the mid and upper 80s, but with some of that rain scattered around the area at 5 o'clock, some local cooling, about 84. And down in Rio as the Olympics continue. Rugby, sailing, tennis taking place tomorrow about 80. Sunny skies expected and light southeast winds there at about uh, 5 to 15 miles per hour. Tonight, mild conditions, as I mentioned, a few clouds around. Humidity levels on the rise for Tuesday, and our dew points today have been between about 55 and 60. But tomorrow, those numbers head back up around 70 or even above. So we'll be getting back to those oppressive levels, and then we'll have a good chance of rain uh, for later this week. But even starting tomorrow, it looks like a uh, at least the chance of some scattered afternoon and evening thunderstorms. Highs tomorrow, mid and upper 80s for us to about 88 Cincinnati, 90 Columbus. Our dew point forecast, still comfortable this evening, but by tomorrow morning, back into the mid and upper 60s. And there you go, there are those numbers up into the low 70s. And that should be the case for most of the remainder of the week. Uh, at least, even though we have the increased humidity, very light winds aloft, so not much steering currents, and it uh, doesn't look like a real active, severe weather pattern. So even though we could see some of those afternoon thunderstorms. Right now, really no threat of any severe weather, although there could be some locally heavy rain from those, but it's pretty dry out there. Our Beaver Creek time lapse at the Phillips Company Storm Team 2 camera showing a partly to mostly sunny sky and basically a clear sky on the SVG Chevrolet camera up in Greenville. Live Doppler 2 HD, dry weather on 4th Street, uh, right down there on Kiawe and Wayne Avenue looking at dry conditions too, and no precipitation anywhere around the Miami Valley. And down south, we go at least a little bit of cloud cover central Indiana and some of those clouds will drift into the area tonight but this region of high pressure up over Lake Erie should keep us nice and dry tonight with a quiet weather pattern. We're at 85 degrees northeast wind at 7 but look at that comfortable dew point at Dayton International 56 37 percent the relative humidity and our weather check readings tonight everybody pretty much into the mid and upper 80s Tom Wyckoff in Springfield 87 Barbara Richards one of the warmer spots there at 90 along with Pam Montgomery out in West Alexandria. Uh, no rain tonight, just some of those scattered clouds around, uh, especially again later tonight. We'll see uh, some increase in humidity and some of those scattered low clouds and high level clouds moving back in. Better chance of those scattered thunderstorms tomorrow afternoon and evening. Then the activity wanes. And then on Wednesday, more flaring up again. Again, the primary time, afternoon and evening. Partly cloudy, mild tonight, down to 66 for the low. Tomorrow, partly sunny, more humid, warm. That chance for some scattered showers. Showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon as we get up to 87 degrees. 75 at 10 o'clock, mid 80s at noon, 86 at 4 o'clock, and 83 at 6 p.m. And then Wednesday into the upper 80s, a little better chance of those scattered showers and thunderstorms. Still a chance of mainly afternoon showers and thunderstorms Thursday and Friday. Nighttime lows only dropping into the low 70s. And then over the weekend, finally a cold front approaches us, and that keeps the chance of rain going, but by early next week, slightly cooler temperatures around 84 degrees. So the humidity coming back. It's brown out there. We could use some rain. Hopefully everybody sees some over the next seven days.